All right, Lily, I'll come save you now or whatever. I guess she's fucking stupid little girl. Uh, I think she's fine. Yeah, she's fine. In other games, they're really irritating. So you know what? Fallout 4 and this yeah. handle this completely differently. In Fallout 4, they tell you, the character you, Matt, to care about the child you don't know. Whereas here, it's like, no, I can understand that Sebastian cares. Plus, they had a nice cutscene where he was, like, having a happy family. Yeah. And that's more than some games do. I don't Some games are like, don't even show yeah. that. They're just but like... The, the distinction is, like, you don't have to care about the kid. You have to understand that Sebastian cares. And that's fine, because you care about Sebastian, so you want Sebastian oh, to be happy. Thank God. Well, I guess... Founder. You, I guess you care about him. I don't, I don't know. He's, he's kind of a weird asshole. And a drunk and a... He was kind of a piece of shit from second one in Evil Within. Yeah. Is this gonna fucking lead us back to the fucking egg? Why is it to the car, though? I don't know. Footprints. Who do they belong to? He's using all his powers of deduction. Go to the car? Oh, that was somebody else's footprints. Yeah. This is where Lily stopped here to hide. Head. Head. He's piecing it all together. Using his magic vision. All right, you're supposed to do that part first, then maybe look at the second. One. I did it backwards. I uh, guess it. Guess it can. Okay. Must be in that warehouse. Smart That's girl. why we couldn't get in there. Lots of good places to hide in there, I bet. I've hidden many a warehouse in my day. I cleared this place out, so I get to do this easy. Awesome. Yeah, I guess. I mean, that's- that's the benefits of an open world thing, I suppose. Lucky us. So what's gonna actually be activated? Something. Anything. Lily? Yeah, see, there we go. Uh, uh, big Shit. activations. Lily? Watch that fucking blow Lily? open. Lily? Yeah, did you see it? Yeah, from yeah, it's glitching out. Okay, fuck this. This is a bunch of crap. She the, probably crawled through here. I was right when I Gotta looked at through. it and saw that it was going to be movable because it's a different type of texture. Where, yeah, where Balrog had, types with his, his punch of gloves. Of but he girl. had no urgency to okay. open up that piece of wood before. I just gotta find her. There's no reason to. Yeah. It's just a leg. <laughs> yeah, smash it open while you're here. I'm mad. I don't enjoy this! Look at me, I'm a mad jerk character guy. I'm, I'm really excited for that predator skill. So you want me to go up? Or the, let's, let's explore the floor first. Well, oh, there's definitely at least one enemy. Looks like he's, he's doing smashy washy so... Boy, I'm actually really glad that, uh, this... Fuck! Oh god, that thing almost crushed your spinal column like Worf. Oh, and now he's gone. Just like Worf. What? Dashed off. Must have gone through here. Great. Three. Five, actually, I think. It's, it's sure giving this one enemy a lot of uh, cinematic flair when he's just a regular guy. Yeah, weird, huh? Regular disgusting. In enemy. fact, that was kind of a trade ammo-wise. Yeah. You got an axe, though, so... I sure did. Catch your blessings. Oh, man. Oh. What about going up, though? This is so much fucking better than the original game. Yeah. It's not even close. This feels like it has a cohesive vision that they actually worked on and made. Like, I was thinking about all the elements that were in the first one, where it's like, there's the doctor running around that you helped, then there's, there's Leslie, Leslie, then there's Kidman, then there's uh, Oda, then there's Ruvik, then there's... Joseph is his name, right? Uh, yeah, Joseph Oda. With glasses. Or, you know, glasses. Yuri Lowenthal. And then there was like, you know, when you go into the insane asylum parts and you're talking to those mysterious patients behind the doors, then there's like the traps elements. High-grade weapon parts. There's just so much going on that it like, yeah, it, it lacking cohesion is like one of the main things. Cohesion. Yeah. 
like this, ha this like has like this serial killer or, or whatever walking around. Uh, Kimmins on the phone with you. I'm gonna save this. And then this. there's a big bad somewhere. Uh, and but but your main goal is just to like what was our main goal in the first game? Just to what's going on? It, it was to get that, out. That was the number one main goal. What's going on? And it's like <laughs> it's this weird thing where like 90% of the game through the game they figure out we're in someone's head, and it's yeah. like that's what the players assume the whole game Time. because it's all crazy nonsense. But but what they they thought with their scene was real. But where's Lily? Uh, she's in the blood pool. There you go. Oh, fuck. You, what are you going to be shooting the fuck out of now? <laughs> I'm actually going to backtrack a little that, bit. That was a small boss fountain. Yeah. Fuck. <sighs> Fine. No, I'm not going to backtrack. Because every time I backtracked, it's then brought me back to the place that I should backtrack to. Is that, that, that's his wife. <sighs> yeah, that is his wife. Who works for STEM, by the way? I'm assuming. You can see her in the, in the ending of the first game for some reason. Not a bad hiding spot. That's pretty good. Oh, there he is. Yeah. I like to think that he's a guy that... Because they don't know about him. They're baffled by his presence, right? Yeah. But he has to be physically hooked into the machine somewhere. Somewhere. So I imagine he's a guy they put into STEM. And, and was and totally he, normal. And he's totally woke, and everyone else is not. And when this happened, he's just like, no, I'm not an evil, and that's enough. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was going to say the Him, evil within, too. The murder with the camera. Oh. And the son of a bitch has my little girl. I was so he's close. He's shaking the doll like he, the doll is going to help him. Calm down. Tell me what you know. Think. Tell I me. No more signals coming into this communicator. I need to find that another way. That means you've cleared out everything. Not sure I can trust him, but he wants out of here as bad as I want to find Lily. O'Neal. That glitched Sebastian. out really bad when I started the sprint animation like that. Is that you? You're breaking up. Shit. Not now. Maybe it'll work better outside. Yeah. It probably will. It's won't. you're in a brain. Why would lo why would logic work like that? Yeah, it's, it's it's all he knows, you know. I guess. Oh fuck! Like, please tell me there's like a cthulhu size thing outside. That'd be awesome. Music, maybe, huh? Maybe warping back to Beacon or something. Just like Beacon, different music but similar in execution. Yeah. Whoa. Huh. Nice. What the hell? See, I really like these. Oh, sections I wanted, that... I wanted to go up that staircase. Well, it, you were, you would never be able to. I was able to at the beginning. But you chose not to. What? Oh, it's another it's dead guy. Thing. I really like these serial killer sections. Oh, he, that's what he's got the. Oh yeah, he's a super interesting villain. It's like a JoJo villain almost. Yeah, yeah. He's wearing a flashy suit, his hair he's, is kind of He's funny. got so, a stupid he, motive. He has Dio's powers. This is way stronger than Dio, man. Localized time stop? You couldn't investigate that, huh? Oh, I could? No, I said you. I don't think you can because a prompt didn't appear. But I'd assume you Well, could. you know what did happen? This. Yeah. When I turned back. I fucking love impossible space. I've said it before, and boy, will I say it again. Smile. There you are. But where is Lily? Can't let drop kick away again. Him. I don't care if you're a serial killer with supernatural powers. A good old drop kick will tell him what, to, what for. This is probably where you had to go all along anyway. I want to see what's up here. And I'm willing to let that man who has my daughter get away. There might be an, a weapon part. If there's a weapon part, I'll be so happy. There is nothing. Shut part. your fucking mouth. It mother. was all for nothing. I bet that would be open before I did this. Damn it. I don't know. I don't know about that. 
I gotta get O'Neal before... Before he kills O'Neal. Which we know doesn't happen. Wow. Because of that awesome clip <laughs> flying around the internet. Mm -hmm. It's funny, I feel like that clip, which we will not mention until we can try and find it. Um, I mean, describe. Yeah. Feel, it feels like that turned everybody around on this game. Anybody that had, like... Reservations. Reservations at all went, okay. Well, <laughs> like, I was into it before when I just saw that, like, yeah, you know, there's some, some Bethesda references. Like, a lot of Bethesda hey, games do. You! But... The girl! Where is she? Muda Muda. Yeah, a little bit. Wait. That's cool. Did he? Oh, whoa. Oh, whoa. Is that gonna spawn in? Wait. Oh, those guys, okay. Is this a run situation or is this a fight? Oh, shit! Back that thing up. No, that's that's backing up too much. <gasps> now you're cornered. What just happened? I don't know. I think the geometry, like, actually flung it away. Wow, you still took a hit somehow. Did that kill it? Yeah. Come on, motherfucker. Oh! Fuck. Heal, heal. It also, like, that clipped through the, the bit of the wall to, to hit you. That kind of sucked, but whatever. It looked like it did, at least. Oh, they're not so it. tough. No. It, I figured out their secret. Was shooting them in the head? No. So you can. If you can punk them. What's the secret? Shooting them? Yeah. Okay. You die? I don't think so. That's a death scream. Lost him again. Hope I can reach O'Neill this yeah, time. Yeah, O'Neill will save us. Hey, O'Neill. Save us. O'Neill, it's Sebastian. You're still alive? <laughs> I mean, you're still alive. Good. Were you able to locate the core? No. But I know who has her. And he's got powers like nothing else in here. But I lost him. I think I can help you out with that. Really? I picked up a frequency I've never seen before. It's coming from City. Huh. Great. Where's that? Look up. Do you see a building with a big clock tower? I do. Yeah. That's it. How in the hell am I supposed to get up there? It's a bit complex. Come back here, I can explain. Thanks right. for fucking nothing, O'Neal. It's like getting called up to the IT room because they can explain to, like, lock your passwords and shit. Weird. Oh, new enemies. That's hilarious. The red blood moon rises. That's just a knife floating around. Sails, sails, come in, come one and all. Oh, fuck. I remember how, like, fucking shaken I was when the red moon appears in fucking Breath of the Wild, and I literally threw my controller. Fuck. Because I, I was like, what the fuck is this? Yeah. Well, so unexpected. Well, that just happened to me. Yeah. So that's their... So I was about to say, like, oh, I good thing I everything. cleared out the whole map, right? I'll be easy to get back. Oh, fuck. Well, I think their enemy placements are probably different. Not that different. So where is... Uh, did you set a waypoint, Phoneals? Yeah. He's that way. That's, a, that's one of those uh, ones that can't be stealth killed in one hit. Yeah, but you should still do it if you can. Oh, hell yeah, it makes the fight a lot easier. Oh, God. Wait, no. no. She didn't see me. Yeah, she's just angry. And she's running off now. Yeah. Is that even a direction? No, it's not. I'm just going... Through the bush. Because if you have that weird texture on you, that means you're invisible, so I guess yeah. you're fine, but. Oh, shit. 
Oh. That wow. wow. Wow, girl. Let's wait for you to come back here. With one. Yeah, make you do your fucking dash. Jeez, that's scary. Sure is. Damn it. Oh, what? Oh, so I God thought, damn. I thought, so what happens when you kill them with the, the last bit of damage from your melee weapon is that you get that custom animation. And I was like, maybe the stealth kill plus that plus it would be one enough, shotgun is just not, enough. It's like, say no. two shotguns. Yeah. Darn. Well, it's going to put you basically. It's going to put there, me right there. Uh, yeah. Watch it not. Oh, boy. That'd be awkward. The, I feel like this game's, um... That was weird. Oh, I gotta... Can't, can't not, come on, seriously? Really? Come on. So that's all in that street, like, pretty close to O'Neill's, too. Yeah, touch bad button? That doesn't do it. Oh, that! She didn't load in before! She did. Because sometimes touch bad button is to skip. Yeah. That was weird, though. Sure was. That you're how to just start overlay over that cutscene, but whatever. We gotta get back to O'Neill. Feel sick. Yeah, no. I... Uh, what I was saying is that I think that the game's use of uh, health and ammunition has actually been kind of fantastic so far. In what sense? I'm always low. Yeah, yeah. But I'm almost never dry. Yeah, Maybe. medical syringes have not been uncommon, so. I'm always weak. I'm never fucked. Shit. That's my favorite bush. Whoa! That was fucked up. Yes, it was. Is that it? Oh yeah, it was. Yeah. Okay, so it's so that's that's the way to go. Sure is. It sucks that one shotgun shell and your plan didn't work out. Yeah. Because that, that would have be been the most a optimal thing. Hell yeah, it would have been. Oh, well. So let's uh, let's see if we can't get those items that I missed the first time. That are Which up here. Which specific? Like why? The very in the very in the Pat versus Evil Within Part One. I missed some items up here on this roof. I wasn't no. going to come and back and get them. No. Oh, yeah. That's true. I, I, I wasn't going to come back and get them, but since we're here... What? what? Uh... Oh. oh, fuck. It knows. It knows you're coming back for those items. Shit. Oh, there's so many big items. Yeah, I, I You know just what I bet I can't do? This. Wait, go down a ladder. But I want the gel. What? Okay. Why is he like a mix between an RE5 monster and a Silent Hill monster? I agree. Like, I could see that being manufactured. As the conjoined body horror of, like, a Silent Hill monster, but, like, the, the the teeth and, like, maw of, like, a RE5. Like, specifically those black dogs that had... Split. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Now there's O'Neill's safe house. I'm here! It's me! How's the rest of the fucking street? Because this... Ah, <sighs> this one's... Hey everyone, it's me, Stan. It's not actually that bad. Somehow. Also... Yeah, but you didn't even know about that, uh... That conjoined monster until, like... Fair enough. That being said, I have... Uh, there's... Uh, I'm close enough to the wow. door that I'm just getting better. Yeah, I can't believe they didn't at least place one monster there. I'm also surprised. But now we're at the greatest monster's house of all, O'Neil. O'Neil. The monster O'Neil. Fucker! I'm here. I'm home. It'd be funny if he did that. And he would always scream <laughs> ah! when you walk in. Can't fucking believe it. There's that guy. Oh man. You can get some coffee. Yeah. Let's see what I can upgrade. 190 doesn't look like I can upgrade much. This is 400. <sighs> Critical damage. 
Oh, that means I'm gonna have to be aiming for weak points, which I suck at. Fucking suck at it. 240. It's gonna 100. be a while before you get one of those high grade parts. Man. Harpoon bolts. This just. I, I, I thought the harpoon pole was cool in the this first game. This just increases. Actually. Wow. That just increases. Wait, what, what was the last up there? It, it turns it on fire. Yeah, which that's is the that's, same thing it did in the first yeah, game. Yeah, exactly. And it would always almost it would always kill at that point because it, the fire killed everything. Wow, these are actually really strong upgrades. <sighs> but I'd prefer to keep my regular weapons. Let's see what we can craft in terms of handgun bullets. Great. What about medical syringes? I will create one. That's enough. Basically. Yeah, I'm like good on that. Smoke bomb would be useful for when there's a crowd. You can just smoke bomb them and just, like, stealth kill them all. Mm -hmm. I'm glad I haven't made any parts in the field, because it's a big fucking waste of money. Money? With a weapon parts. But, Gel? I mean, it can get you out of situations, I assume, when it's like, you've been like, oh, I have to go all the way back here to craft. All right. You know what? Before we talk to O'Neil, let's save the fucking game. Because O'Neil's going to teleport us to fucking fun town. Yeah, but I'd assume it would save there regardless. Yeah. But who knows with O'Neil? I don't think I have enough ammo left in the fucking world to go kill all the enemies that spawn on the street. For all okay. you know, he's going to send you Not to the sure cycling okay bin. Not sure the right word, but yeah, I made it. Now, tell me how to get to City Hall. Union was built with a sort of backstage area, so Mobius operatives could observe the test subjects in secret. Right. Most of these passageways are still intact enough to bypass the fissures in Union. Uh-huh. But chunks of the city are floating in the air. How are their tunnels? They're mine They're tunnels. Yeah. Not tunnels. When you go in and out of them, you're basically phase shifting. We call it the marrow. It exists in a layer separate I've been from there. what you see. Yeah. It doesn't make any like, sense. Fortunately for you, it doesn't have to make sense. It just has to work. But it's a maze down there. You take the wrong path, you could end up on the other side of town. Where's this Merrill that gets me to City Hall? And who comes up with these ridiculous names? I'll mark the location of the port. It's in oh, the I'm not, not going to tell you who Looks comes like up with the names. a regular computer, but it's not. I'll give you the password. Yeah, it's the one that was always locked. Yep. Once you're inside, follow the marker to exit B2. That should take you straight to City Hall. You could have told me this on my communicator, you know. Maybe so. But I couldn't have given you this. Oh. The passageways are still intact, but the collapse of Union has caused infrastructure issues. My communicator says that the gas leak is blocking oh, well, the path thanks, to exit B2. You'd never make sure. it through alive without this. Deadly gas leaks, huh? <laughs> thanks for saving the worst. Okay, Neil sucks, but he, like, he gave you a valuable so piece of equipment. I doubt that it's the worst you'll encounter. Yeah, I appreciate You're that. I can also see a big Anything shiny thing else behind you need me. To know before you go? Gas, gas mask. mask. Oh, it's a brand new one. It was complimenting O'Neill. It was like, he's nice enough to give you this. Behind the curtain. Ooh. Phew. Hey, O'Neill, do you have way. new things to say? Oh, yeah, you do. Yeah, you do. Find well, that I, signal. Like How did you know so. that this signal was coming from the guy I mentioned? My communicator went crazy when you tried to call earlier. Something was interfering with it. A frequency I'd never seen before. And it was coming from the warehouse that you were just in. Right before you called? The signal disappeared, and then bam, it was at City Hall. When you said this guy was powerful and that you lost him, well, it stood to reason that he was the source of the signal. What Works kind of me. powers are we talking about here? He I don't know the, the, the nature of his stand. Like he was controlling them. Then he just teleported away. Reminds me of the last time I was in STEM. But everyone in Union was tested before they were placed in STEM. Yeah, well, you but fucked no up. There's no way they'd let a psycho in here. Well, I'm here. They didn't test me. But you're not a psychopath. I'm not. Right. Yeah. <laughs> I kicked my fucking ass Why do you through he here. Chose to camp yeah. out at City Hall. It's probably got something to do with a stable field emitter we set up there. Damn it! What's a stable field emitter? <laughs> I love it's a machine that, that Sebastian has no idea how this works. And that's that's the first thing O'Neill said to him. He's like, "Shouldn't you know his shit?" Core, so we only use them for emergencies. I fucking love it. It doesn't seem like it's working. Yeah. Uh, we sent Harrison and a security team to set it up when we arrived. I hope they're okay. They're not. They're fucking dead. Maybe you should come with me. If I can find Lily, we can get out of here together. No way. No way. I'm not leaving <laughs> a safe room unless it's to get out of Union entirely or someone forces me out. 
And who the hell is this Lily you keep mentioning? My daughter. Lily is my daughter. She's the core. <sighs> no wonder you're so determined to find her. I could really use your help. I'll help you from in here when I can, but I'm not going out there. She's just a little girl. I know, but appealing to my better nature isn't a good way to convince Yeah, because I'm an something. asshole. <laughs> Sorry. I'm just not built that way. Yeah, I've noticed. What a piece of shit. Appealing, appealing to my humanity is no way to get me to do nothing. What a stupid, huge mistake you've made to appeal to my humanity. In fact, I'm furious you would do so. What, you think I'm so stupid that I want to be a good person? And I want the gas mask back. Hand it over. Yeah, I want you to smell those horrible fucking death farts. <laughs> I want you to smell the mind gas. Well, luckily, I, by exploring this whole thing, at least I can cut down on, on some backtracking. Uh, communicator. Not picking up anything new! That's good. So, yeah, City Hall, I guess. Thought I heard a weird music for a second. Yeah, I also- I think it was the mirror. Yeah, maybe. I just heard a weird noise. Okay, yeah, nothing. Yeah, it seems awfully quiet. Easiest way that I can think of is to the right of the church. Hey, you a see that? Too raff under the yeah. And there's no guy under there. In fact, I can clearly see no guy under there. Better be no guy no under there. Fucking sick. Gunpowder. How does right shelf for a second? Yeah, this this I feel. Oh, by the way, somebody told me that if in the the church encounter. If you run out the door, Sebastian yells out, "Man, fuck this!" Yeah, I saw, I saw, I saw a video that was telling someone about uh, the evil of it. I was like, "Yeah, there's some point where you run out of an encounter, your character just goes, fuck this!" Isn't that fantastic? I wish you had gotten that. Oh well. That that's an that's an instant tone setter. Unfortunately, my my balls were too huge at that moment. I just handled yeah, the situation. Yeah, I think you died during that encounter, but. I have my, I, I think. Oh wow, lucky me. Not really much going on. There's stop, a guy stop, way, stop, way stop. out there. Oh, I thought I heard a guy. I thought I heard a footstep for a second. There's a body behind that car, but... It's okay, a friendly it's, body. It's a friendly... It's a lot of stewardesses that are dead. I've, I've seen the same... I, th I, th I think it's supposed suit. to be generic office lady. Yeah, I guess. Also, this looks sense. like an area I haven't actually gone into. So. <sighs> Fuck you. Yeah, there you go. You're safe in here. No, oh, wait, I have. I have gone in here. There's nothing in there, yeah. Does she like what? I so in all these these moments we have yet to see her during these blue shots, right? Yeah. Like, is she actually wandering the street? I don't think so, because I'd imagine we would have seen her at least once. Plus, it's a very distinctive character model flowing bullshit all over it. She's also really. Jeez, she's. Weird. Oh wow! Yeah, there he is. So he's definitely new. Oh, there's. Yeah, there's two. 